Hello world and welcome back to Pokemon Black 2 Randomized. Um, in the last episode we had, what was it, was it a massive, was it a massive text dump last episode? Was that what it was? Anyway, I've recorded an episode since then, but I was just constantly shouting for no apparent reason, like I'm really ticked off, and I don't know why. So, um... I'm... Sorry. Um... So yeah, I'm gonna redo this one. Cause... I mean, there's a very nice song that this town plays. I'm actually going to turn my volume up for so I can actually hear. And this song... ...can be helped by these people. This one? Who adds like synthesizer? Though I think he's supposed to be whistling, but this, this is not whistling. And before y'all say that, you know, this is Pokemon and they have limited sound capabilities, I would like to first point out that this is on the DS, so they've got a lot of memory capabilities. And second of all, I would like to come down here. And have a Pokemon battle. With this Clefairy. Who has unnerved? Oh no. Well, I wasn't going to eat a berry anyway. Um, yeah. Come down here. Just gonna go through there. Go through there. And come to this guy in front of the brazier. In front of the brazier. And that is a voice. that, probably for the first time, is a voice in Pokemon, which is beautiful. And then there's this guy. Who adds guitar. This way, those two, that one. And then in here, hopefully, is a girl. Who kicks me out because she's practicing. Gosh dang it. And we get into another Pokemon battle, so... I really don't want to have to, um... Throw up a repel? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Wow. There we go. Um, yeah, I don't want to have to throw up a repel. Um, 
Now, the one thing that I noticed at the very end of last episode, after 30 minutes of shouting... And... That guy says... He knows that his style doesn't fit the town. And when you talk to them again, it turns them off, so... Maybe, with, you know, the whistle... Ah... Uh, is a whistle and voice th this for all wants? Blah, blah. Also, I'm really annoyed at how slow this is. Eek. I'm practicing get out. Okay, so we go around. So he's. Buns. Um. Okay, does this girl have a name? Woo. Eek. I'm practicing get out, so she doesn't have a name. Okay. Because there's a very nice lady. Who also doesn't have a name. Somewhere... In... This house. I think. Nope. Not that house. This house. Wow. Huh. <sighs> totally hooked on the sandwiches. Pokemon make adorable. No. I don't think it's this house. It's one of these houses. One of these houses has... A person who's like, the four people, like, the four musicians in this town are... And so, I've, like... That guy down there, the guy singing in front of the brazier, is Kunst. Um, this guy up here... He's Eichmann. And honestly, I don't think his music is too terribly... off. But apparently it is. Um, it's not one of these people. Oh my god. I just sort of talked to him. He's... He's the fourth person. Yeah, he's, he's the one who does random tribal throat singing. Okay. Slash beatboxing. I don't know what he does. But... So, all four people are now on. Blah, blee, blue. Eek. Practice and get out. Oh! 
Okay. Okay. That's fine. This means I'm gonna have to walk through this grass again. And risk a Pokemon encounter. <laughs> to turn this quote wrong style of guitar off. This here microphone's all screwed, I can't... I can sing real good, promise. Yeah, I don't... I honestly don't hear what, um... That man does. Yeah, it is Derleaf, Eichmann, Russo, and Kunst. And that guy's name is Russo. So we found the fourth person. Question has become because you're Durleith. Just gonna circle across. Because I don't wanna have to walk all the way around the town. To turn Kunst off. Don't care. Starting to care. Uh, just no. Mm, no. Run away. I honestly don't hear what this guy is doing. He's turned on right now. So it sounds like this is the guy who beatboxes. Yeah. I think that's the ambient sound of the town. I'm not entirely sure. I'm going to reset the noise. And turn uh, Russo back on. Someone secret, otherwise they'll hate your face. You're a guy who I battled. You cross bridges. Wow, that's an interesting character trait, I must say.
Okay. See, this is the point where I wish there was still the mechanic where, um, if you had a Pokemon that had cut, you could just cut through all of the grass. And just be like, nope, I don't want to walk through any of this. Okay. This is just with Kun, uh, just with Russo. I was about to resort to just go onto the internet, but no. I have a feeling I know what it is. I actually read the um, automatopoeia of her thing, and I think I know what she's singing to, and it's not this Russo guy. We're going to switch up. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, sorry. We're going to switch up the. We're going to switch up the soundtrack a little bit. So doing this anyway, even without me shouting. Uh, well, I guess this would have been the second episode of me just shouting. Oh, and I needed to uh, turn off you. that way. Oh. Whatever. Okay. Single person. Uh, dirt a leaf. Eek. I'm practicing. Get out. Gosh dang it. Okay. I didn't want to have to do this, but you leave me no choice. Two EXP shows. Cool. Love stone, fluffy tail, flying gem, band, crest, hard, helix, ice. Oh gosh. I want S. I want S. Why is this sorted by. Um, why is it sorted by name? Mm-hmm. haven't fought this one. I've fought most of the um, sports people because they just run everywhere and I was not really paying attention to where I was going. 
but apparently I haven't fought this one. So, um, you are dark. At heart, I do believe. So a spatial rend is not going to be any sort of special effectiveness. But that is not going to be effective for dark. And that is not going to be very effective because that is your typing. Uh. And that is just going to be a powerful move. Wow, that wasn't powerful. I think. This power gem is the only thing that this Mandibuzz knows. Which is really sad when you think about it. But I mean... Just keep on... Keep on keeping on. We'll get there eventually. Hopefully with this Pokemon, I would hate to have to go to... Yeah, there we go. You got this, Amarok. Ding. 16. Do -do 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 -do. Repels of where we are. Yeah, you see, this is such a large town. Okay, so we've already tried just you. We've tried just Flute Man up there. Ah, uh, permutations. Uh, I'm going to be angry if. It's not just a permutation question, but also an order question. <sighs> Ding. Eek. I'm practicing get out. Okay. That's it. We're going on to the internet. Village. Music. Bulbapedia. Places of interest. There's a woman in the furthest house on the right that will heal the player's Pokemon. Um, Village Bridge Restaurant is apparently a thing. Secret singing area. Black 2, white 2, there's a secret room under the bridge where a girl is singing. Upon finding her, she forces the player out. A girl on the bridge will reward the player for finding the source of the mysterious voice. Grass flute. Okay, variable scoring. Grass Flute, Second Acoustic Guitar, Beatboxing, and Echna Vocal Parts. Um... Whatever. Oh, this beatboxing is Robert on the bridge and then Echna is right. Added by speaking to Durth, Eichmann, Russo, and Kunz, respectively. The initial kana of these NPCs' names can make up the word that, meaning dusk. That's nice. Okay. 
so, um... Fucking shit. Fun fact... There is no solution. Yeah, there is no solution. So I'm just gonna have this guy back on. Right. There is no solution. It's just pretty. And I got an item from this girl for divulging the secret, which I wouldn't have done, personally. But yeah, so that was the almost the entirety of an episode wasted. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Really? Yes! And you are... Someone who gives me some mail. Okay. Um, Selby, do you care? You have... ...to survive this, to be eligible to be caught. Okay. Okay, so it's a speed boost. Speed boost is nice. Send out Zerk. Huh. Let's see how well you can survive all of this. Four. Perfecto. Speed boost. Okay. Um. Was the map, was the second mask ball in the last episode? You guys, I think it was. If not, we found a second mask ball. Uh, quick balls not going to work because quick balls are at the beginning of the battle, not um the speed base of Pokemon. Okay, Celebi. You have three balls. Go. I think just threatening these Pokemon with, like, a time limit of how many balls that they have to get in before... Um... Oh, I didn't... Oh... I'm that that's habit that I've developed. Um let's open the dowsing machine because I have a feeling that Oh this is going to be Or maybe it's up there. Who knows? Can I surf? I can surf. But I don't have waterfalls, so I'm not gonna go that way. I'll go this way. Grab this Pokemon Pokeball, which is Max Revive, which is pretty swag. Uh, can't go anywhere else. And this seems to be blocked off with rocks. Yes. 
What is the water Pokemon that we can find in here? Uh, Yamask. Yamask. So you're a ghost. If you can survive this, I'll think about it. So close. So we need to come back here when we have the um when we have waterfall. Genesec, Genesec, we have we have drives for Genesec. We have Genesec drives, so um I think that changes Genesec's actual thing. Let me check. Gen Sect. Genesec. Um it is not known to evolve into or from any Pokemon, though the drive inserted into in the cannon on its back is visibly different within the sprites depending on the drive it is holding. When it is not holding a drive, the light is orange and techno bland. Oh, okay. So, um. It's a specific move. Okay. Cat, what are you what are you thinking? What okay, hello. Yes, hi. Please don't knock my microphone. No, no. you can be here. You can you can be a lap cuddle. Okay. But I mean this the chance of this Pokemon having this is not very, um, not very, not very high, so, um, I was about to say, let's see if you can impress me. Um, I must say, you kind of have. In such a fact that I'm going to use Magnuston, which, if it doesn't kill you, will kill you eventually. So, yeah, that's a thing that's going to happen to you. No, one shot kill. Okay. I'm a yes. This item that I blocked this side for is also unreachable. Awesome. So we walk around, we find another... Oh, we find a Doduo. Doduo. <laughs> okay, whatever. So yes, yeah, so we need to go up that waterfall and we are plotting! Oh, look at all the plot. I have a version. Item? I think I can. Do you think it's messing up the scripting in that I just walk around these things? Like, um... I don't know whether it's the last episode or a couple of episodes back, but... Kobalion just sort of jumped down at me and... No, he was standing there, and I just walked right by him. I'm gonna see what happens. I'm going to save state there. And wait for that to go down. And I'm gonna see... Oh! 
were encountering. Okay. Well... Okay. I didn't expect that to happen. Yahoo, I haven't seen you since I ran into you in Castalia Town. Are you here to battle with Grandpa? Yep, off Lucid City's gym leader, Dragon, is my grandpa. We're not really related, though. Oh, the gym's that way. Before challenging it, you might want to go to Route 9. Still, your Pokemon really respect you, blah blah blah. Listen, Iris, I just came here because I need to go in here and heal up. Second, do 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 do, and then be all like, talk to you again, and say no, and we just stay here, and we say thank you all for watching. My name is Ben Simon. You have been amazing. I love you all, and goodbye. Huh. <sighs> cool.